up you guys welcome to the vlog um so i'm just at the gym right now my phone is gonna die i don't know how much longer it's got life but we're gonna try to film something you know the drill so i got here relatively early so we're gonna hit a quick glute leg day more hamstring focused and uh quad so i'm really excited um but yeah let's go eat Why I have so many icks, like icks. So, uh, finished my workout, it was fantastic, as per usual. Um, feeling really good and strong. I think my coach is trying to kill me because uh, my legs hurt, like everything hurts. Like I'm I'm like shaking, you know, and your body's like, muscles are like, ah. So anyways, I'm gonna make dinner right now, and then I'm gonna shower, get ready for later tonight. Hopefully I'll vlog that, probably on my phone, uh, be a crappy quality, but. Say la vie. Um, but just like number one ick, your locker. Why does it have to be right beside me? Why? Second ick, why, like I'm sure the, the, the fellas watching this video are probably like, oh, we would love to see that. No, I genuinely don't like to see a naked woman. I don't. I genuinely don't like when your tatas are all in the bit, in the, you know, every, like you just naked. It's like, girl, turn around, cover yourself, go in the change room. That's what they're for. I understand it's a locker room. Yes, you can change, but like, why naked? Like, I don't, I, I personally, I don't look at it and be like, oh my God, like, ew. I'm like, ugh, I'm like, it's like cringe. It's like gross. It's like, ugh. Anyways, <laughs> number three ick is, oh, when guys, when guys like be annoying and they're like, how many, how many sets you got? It's like, bro. I am working as, like, I get to sit here as long as I freaking want. Like, I understand it's frustrating when you see somebody who's on their phone who's literally not working out. But you know what? That's life. Too bad. You have to wait. Move on. Um, another one. Oh, yeah. I was talking about this with a friend. But it really makes me laugh is when um, you have a certain weight on whatever machine you're doing. And like the person beside you like looks at you and is like, oh, is she going to lift that? And then it's like almost like they have to one up you as a guy, like kind of be like, well, I got to go at least equivalent or more. It's like, bro, like we're not on the same level. But again, like if you have like really skinny legs, you know, then maybe you should work on them. But anyways, I was working on glutes, lots of glutes today. Oh my gosh, I'm sweating. Like ugh, my hair is like a greasy mess. Let's get showered, let's get eating, but those are my eggs and those are my things at the gym. So yeah. Okay, bye. <laughs> Morning! I am just about to get dressed. I literally slept in my makeup. Yes, you do not do that as a makeup artist, but I did it because I had it on late and I was like, you know what? I don't have the <laughs> mental capacity to take it off, so I didn't. I just, I took off my mascara because that I can't sleep with. My eye will be blown up. So, hair is still gorgeous from yesterday. Um, so I was supposed to, um, yes, I know, I know. I was uh, supposed to hang out with April and uh, her dog decided to eat a thing and got very ill, like ill, ill, ill. So um, that sucks. So I literally <laughs> got all dressed, got downtown, and she was like, I have to go to the emergency vet. I was like, oh my gosh. And then, yeah, pretty much I just went back home and I was like, okay, well, I guess I'm not going out, which is like totally okay. It's just like, I felt bad. Like she felt bad for me, but I was like, dang, you gotta, you gotta deal with your shit. You know, it's like, it's like having children, you know? Your kid gets sick, your kid gets sick. When they go downhill fast, they go downhill fast. <laughs> so I'm just making, uh, so I'm going to the gym very early. I usually don't drink anything, but I weighed myself all time low, 181, what? So, um, so basically I, perfect. 
So I'm going to replace one of my snacks, like the snack I have later. I'm going to eat that now. So I usually have a rice cake with almond um, butter and, uh, or, or sorry, almond all natural peanut butter. What am I saying? I always say almond butter, but that's not what it means. But anyway, and then uh, a protein shake. So I'm going to do that right now because I feel very tired. I didn't sleep very well last night. Um, I don't know why, but I didn't. Um, oh, here it is. I was like, Karina gave me one and it's like uh, a flavored one. I know I have to make the, I have to spend some money today, which is like so annoying. I really do want to make paint for things. But say lovey. That's fun. It smells divine. I need a shaker thing in it. So it is currently 7 o'clock. The gym just opened. So I'm going to try to make it there for 7.30. I'm going to eat this on the car, in the car. And oh yeah, she's a, she's a protein powder needs to be like thin, flat, not exciting. This one's like way too bubbly, but whatever. Hey Google, what's the weather? Currently in Winnipeg, it's seven degrees and mostly cloudy. Today, it'll be partly cloudy with a forecasted high of 19 and a low of four. So that's one, <laughs> All right. Maybe I'll catch some footage at the gym. I literally was going to do an outfit check yesterday. Didn't do that. I was waiting for like the club. I don't know. I don't know what I was waiting for, but yep, literally you didn't see anything from last night. So, okay. Bye. Hi! Hi! Reunited! So, where are we going, Brittany? Tell them. We are going for coffee first yes. to Starbucks. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to Dufresne for a cake decorating. Cake I think decorating right. class. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna take you guys along. Enjoy the ride. So yes. let's go. <laughs> she's like, she's like doing her hair. Say hi. Cheers. And we're on our way because coffee was good, conversation was good. So now we're on our way to the cake. Yeah. Penalties and stuff. Anyways. Oh, yeah. We're here. Let's go. Cute. Hi, hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Well. Summer, spring going oh, free so far. Yeah, oh, so good. Nice. Yeah. Are you doing any training and stuff for you? Yeah. Here? Of course, always. <laughs> always, so yeah. So fun. Yeah. Any, like, is it like for competition? Yeah. 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 It's a Nice. Oh, yeah. oh my god, that's so far away. I know, but <laughs> got to prepare for it. So. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. that's my friend Brittany. Hi, yeah, Brittany. I'm Kelly. Nice to meet you. <laughs> from Ukraine. Yeah. I'm hanging out here every now and again just for events. <laughs> <laughs> I have a party here. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I was like, we were like, oh my god, we're like, let's do this. She's like, yeah, because she celebrated her birthday. Oh, okay. like, let's do it. Yeah. yeah, it's like a nice outing. It is. Yeah. It's like a fun thing. I think there's like a group of people now who come to all of them. And yeah. then like, we have to make everything we can. Yeah. It's so cute. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, well, thanks for coming. Of course. Yeah, have fun. Thank you. Yeah. So. Oh, only for this weekend, though. Okay. But it's kitchen aid, though. Appliances. <laughs> you don't want to blame me? You don't want to understand me? <laughs> oh yeah, that's so fun. Kitchen event with Made by Megs and KitchenAid. Um, so before Meg goes over how to pipe icing and how to decorate and all the must-know baking tips, um, I'll just let you know that our event today wouldn't be possible without KitchenAid. I don't think any baked good ever would be possible without KitchenAid. Um, so um, along with the event, uh, we have a special offer for KitchenAid. You could do 15% off your major appliances. So whether you're planning a dream kitchen or maybe something's not working like it used to and you just have some questions, we'll be happy to guide you through that. Um, we also have a contest to win a KitchenAid mixer at the back. So through the QR code, you can enter to win. And then before you go, I'll invite you to take uh, some KitchenAid and Dufresne uh, spoons from the back so you can start baking and playing at home. Um, yeah, but I'll send it over to Meg to take it away. Have fun. Hello. How's everyone doing? Good. Good. Okay. It's 
started implementing that now. I'm like, people could reply to me, why not? <laughs> so I'm Megs, I'm the owner of Made by Megs. I run what I call Ghost Kitchen out of Captain Space Community Kitchen. It's on St. Anne's Road. Um, so Ghost Bakery or Kitchen, for those of you who don't know, means I share the kitchen with about 20 other businesses. So it's kind of like shift work in and out. We do have a little pickup area that you're welcome to come and check out. I do little pop-ups there so you can come and get treats, custom cakes, all this fun stuff. But I'm going to get into a couple tips about baking and also about icing. So number one most important thing when it comes to baking is even heat in your oven. If your oven is not evenly heated, your bakes might not turn out how you want them to. Even heat really ensures an even rise and that nice golden brown color on the top. So these ovens are really cool because they have the even heat technology and it ensures that the whole uh, oven is evenly heated so you don't have to worry about your products coming out being inflated. Creates consistency which is always what we want. And um, for the icing, this icing here is an American buttercream icing. I've been getting lots of questions today on what's in it. I'm not going to tell you. It is a secret. But it is a classic American buttercream recipe. I just proofed it up a little, added a little of this, added a little of that. So if you are interested in wanting to try and make your own, you can just Google any recipe. They're all pretty much the same. And they all turn out delicious, but I can give you some more detailed tips if you have questions about that. Um, I use my KitchenAid mixer literally every single day. I've been baking since I was a little, little girl, and I've always had a KitchenAid in my house. I always love how pretty they are and all the different colors. Um, I actually prefer to use my KitchenAid mixer at the kitchen instead of the big commercial mixer that we have because it only has three speeds, so I can't really control exactly how fast it's going. So with my KitchenAid mixer, I can go one through 10, which is what I need because I start with the icing and making it on 10 and then I end on one. So it's really nice to have those options. Uh, so now we're gonna get into the decorating. Two things before we get started. The bags are shared, so please just use as much as you need. And also not to touch the tips because as I said, they are shared. And then for the flowers, they are not edible. They are just for decoration, so please do not eat them. Um, I do have some floral tape that you can wrap up the bottoms with if you feel if you want to do that, up to you. I can come around and give you some once we get started. Um, so this is kind of the end design that we're going for, but they don't have to look like this. I want each of them to be unique. I'm excited to see what you guys come up with. Um, you will have two cupcakes in your box, up to you if you want to keep them in the box for decorating or take them out. I'm going to put these fun screens up here so you can see what I'm doing down here. Um, so, with the piping bag, the piping bag is sealed, so you don't have to worry about it coming out of the top. Um, and then you're just going to grab the icing at the top like this and give it a twist. And to apply the icing, you're going to use an even pressure and start to squeeze and rotate, circle, and then you're going to take it again and pull it. I'll show you one more time. And we're going to go down and apply even pressure and pull. And once you get to the end, stop the pressure and pull away. So why are you laughing? Kind of more like a wild flower. I'm really to get us in here. And there we go. We've got the two kind of different designs. So, so we can go and I'll start walking around. If anyone does want to go, they can just stand up. Okay. First. Show them people <laughs> how we do this. Oh, you know what? I didn't even start. I gotta twist this. Oh, my God. Ooh. Ooh, it's coming out. It's too much. Yours has a nice swirl. Oh, did you want another one? Oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah. There's no swirl in there, too. No, but yours is like the pretty swirl. Oh, I guess. I feel like you have to do it slow. Yeah. <laughs> I tried. Oh, it is round. Well, why though? Oh, I guess. No, I have the little thing yeah. in there too, but I don't know. Well, Interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. All right. Well, I want to make this one like better. Okay. There you go. Just a little. I did a little. <laughs> are we vlogging? Yeah, we are. Yes. Oh my God. Come. Say hi. Hi. 
guys. This is May, ba made by May. That's right. Yeah. Do you want to tell them all of that? This we're, is amazing. We're, we're, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Thanks Sorry. for coming. No, <laughs> we're decorating cupcakes. We got the fresh flowers, yes. and I'm excited to see you have a look. Okay. Yay. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sure. Oh my God. Yeah. Thank you so much. Welcome. Yeah, so pretty. Yeah. Great. There we go. You're welcome. You're a bodybuilder? Uh, I'm, I did a show last year and I'm doing wow. another show this year. So, yeah. My dad used to do that. Oh, stop. Yeah, really? Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah, so I used to go to all the shows. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, my God. Yeah. That's cool. I That's love amazing. it. That's yeah, amazing. Yeah. Good for you. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, if you want to tape the end, you can go Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I'm such a dummy. Such a dummy. How do you how do you do it? Does it stick? Or is it like gummy? What side? Which flower are you gonna use? Oh you got oh you got six. Oh, I don't know. Oh my gosh, just lots. <laughs> I don't know how you do it. <laughs> you got like one flower there. <laughs> what is, oh, it is pretty stressful. I feel like because I did, I actually did it with my friend Gio. We actually did a cookie cake. No, sorry. We did a cake decorating class, okay. and I learned how to use this bag for like stringy. Like I, that was. <laughs> Trust me, it did not look this good. <laughs> okay, there's one. Yeah. Oh I'm just, like, I'm just copying you because I don't know what to fine. do. But then I'm like in the middle. Does it have to go in the cupcake or does it just go on the floof? <laughs> Honestly, wherever you want it. I think you. Oh, I can't eat this. Put it back. <laughs> Cute. Yeah, I'm just literally copying you. <laughs> yeah. Is that, do you want it? Okay. Oh, hello. Hi. <laughs> you look so little compared to me. Oh my gosh. Okay, there we go. We only have a little bit of battery life left, but how fun is that? That was fun. That was so much fun. And Meg's so cute. She I love cute. you so much. Shout out to you. Make sure you guys go follow her. She does all the cake things and she's so kind and lovely and yeah that was fun got cupcakes it. to take home you saw yes. it yeah there we go so now we're on our way to cruise around and chat okay bye <laughs> we are in sephora the best place on earth yes. <laughs> so we're at zara zara <laughs> it's cute in here we love it the person with the walkie-talkie. She was around. I was like, oh, sorry. <laughs> so we're leaving now. But it was good. All pretty dresses for Montreal. Happy birthday! <laughs> Here we are, and there we go. We are back getting ready. So the last clip you saw was at my friend Gio's birthday. Um, she had like a little house, not a house party, well, sort of. I mean, there was like UFC, all the things. We were getting ready for church. Yeah, to recap the day, so Brittany and I went shopping yesterday. Um, got some, oh yeah, that's what I wanted to do, is show you some Sephora stuff. So we're gonna try them out. So I wet my beauty blender. I'm gonna do my hair first because I generally um, I'm serving today, so I'm, I'm gonna be with the little kiddos. I'm so excited. And um, okay, so Brittany and I went to we went to just look around, look at dresses, like figure out what kind of dress we're gonna get because you know Montreal. Also, new low weight today. Woo, 181. We're so excited. Um, but yeah, I need to do better on my water intake because yesterday was really bad. So we're gonna do that. Yeah, I went to Sephora, so I'm gonna share with you guys what I got. 
But uh, yeah, my camera died, so I was charging it. And then I just kind of like left it there, was on my phone a little bit, all the things. And um, yeah. Okay, so uh, sorry, I was on the phone, so I finished my hair. And um, what was I gonna say? Oh, I have a lipstick in my bag, so I gotta go get that to show you guys. But to start things off, I got a repurchase of the Sephora um, Size Up Mascara. So if you guys, wait, the sale will be done by the time this video goes live. So if you let me know in the comments what you guys get from the sale, I would love to know. So this is a repurchase. I love this mascara, it's so great. Um, the next one I got is, <laughs> is this uh, Kelly Ray, and it says shake it like you mean it. Uh, the number four, a light dream, um, free dreaming skin wellness diffusing tint. Um, so it's a little guy. I thought this was for $40, but they said, no, it's on for 26, I guess because of the size, but I don't want to use a liquidy one because I have my beauty blender ready. I already primed my face, but the one that I'm like super excited about. Oh, and one more thing is, um, I got a brow pencil. I am kind of going lighter with my hair. Not crazy, but I am going lighter. So I got medium brown. Um, it's the fatter kind of tip, which I'm loving. Um, because for like lazy days, when it's like gym days, just throw it on. So love that. But the one thing that I'm like so excited about is this Sephora Best Skin Ever. I heard a lot of reviews about this. And again, 30% off from this... Uh, foundation so i'm in the color 25n i love the fact that sephora they they say what what uh foundation have you used in the past and they make it very similar easy for you to decide or easy for you to find the right one because it's very similar and they're the ones who pick it out so you're perfect i'm excited to try this haven't opened it haven't pumped it so let's do it together of course oh it's like a moussey kind of thing Let's give her a shot because I've been wearing foundation that is way too dark for me, like way too dark. And um, oh, that looks great. That looks good. Yeah, because the foundations I've been using are like really like when I'm tanned, which is insane. So oh, I love, love the color. So now we're going to go in with concealer. Of course, wet and wild. I need to go back to the States to get some because I genuinely love this mas uh, mascara, this uh, concealer. It's so great. Like, so good. So we're just going to take, uh, I love this stuff too. It was only $5.99. Um, it's Wet n Wild Translucent Setting Powder. I need to go back and get it. A friend of mine offered to go to the States and I was like, oh, I would love to. Um, for the day, but like I just I don't want to take any more days off in this month. So she's like, if you need anything, I'm like, of course I need stuff, but I don't need it. <laughs> I just want to get makeup and groceries, but I don't know. Financially, it's just not not a good look right now. So all right, and then next we're gonna go in. Oh, and then they gave me a free thing. This is the Orbe. Serene Scalp Oil Control Dry Shampoo Powder. So it's fluffy in there. And I'm like, it's gonna puff out. Oh yeah, so it's like that. I don't know, I don't, I don't use stuff like this. No mo, so we are good. All right, so I had these from years ago. They are dibs, I wish. Oh, I just wish these were sold in Sephora because they would sell out all the time. So um, that's just me though. But c'est la vie. These because they're perfect for traveling, which is what I will be doing for the wedding. I can't believe I'm going. Like I literally can't believe I'm going. Like I already talked to my boss and my boss was like, yeah, you're, that's pretty much good. Uh, good to go. And I was like, okay. And then I was like, you know, the flight. I love this stick because I love this blush because it's the perfect amount um, like for your cheeks, but it's like not light enough. Like I really would love her whole collection. Like that would be I iconic. Cute. So now I'm gonna do my brows, do my mascara, do the rest. And then um, yeah, pretty much get ready, do my get dressed. Oh, what did I say? I'm pretty much gonna just, you know, chill out for a bit until I gotta go to church and I'll share that with you guys and then 
<laughs> we'll come back. I gotta get some food, groceries, and then I gotta get gas too. That's another thing. Ugh, I had to get gas yesterday and I was like, oh, I have to pay like, not full price, it's just I go to Costco because I love Costco so much. So I gotta go there after church. That's another thing too. So I'll take you guys along without this big camera because, you know, she's awkward. Okay, bye. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, the Pharisees were, were probably needed in the, in the early Old Testament where that was the covenant, where it was about keeping laws and about works and about everything like that. So they started doing that, but when Jesus came, he's like, no, 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 I'm providing a new way. And you have to ditch those old ways in order to embrace the new ones. Would you believe that the gas was closed? The gas was closed. Costco gas was closed. So now I'm at the grocery store. And I need food. I'll have that for me. Oh my god, it's like many hours later, so I do apologize. Um, after the grocery store, I came home, made some food, and I ate it right here. <laughs> and then I was getting ready to go play soccer, which soccer was so fun, but <laughs> I got a yellow card. Relax. Wasn't my fault. Uh, I got bashed into the boards, and then they called it on both of us, but whatever. <laughs> so now I took my makeup off. I have this calf cramp, I was like came out of nowhere. So I'm just relaxing, so I'm just winding down, gonna watch a movie right now, and then a busy day tomorrow. So with that being said, thank you so much for following along. I hope this wasn't too bad of a vlog, but it is what it is. I love you guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all the things, share, and um, we'll see you guys in the next video.